Hello everybody, welcome back to the Crest of Vanguard modded SMP server. My name is Chicken Funk, and today I am a floating book. And we have a fun a fun surprise in store. Oh, and I can fly good. We are in the next section of the Twilight Forest. The Hydra. And he's in this terrifying area here. This is a fire swamp. And if there was not a nether in this game, I would think this is the creepiest place in the game. So we're going to... Okay, here we go. Let's... He should be in this area here. Unless someone has already killed him. Which is... There he is. Okay. Go back up a sec. We're going to turn up. Oh, hostile creatures is up. Okay, good. So we're not sure we can hear him. We're going to get into this. Think. Oh. He's like, oh, what are you doing, buddy? Scoot those up. Maybe take. Boom. There, nailed him. We're hurting him. I imagine if I couldn't fly, this would be a much harder fight. It was one head. Oh, ouch. Oh, that's... Okay, we're getting... We're nailing him. We got it. Easy peasy. Like I said, flying around and hitting him in like this. What? I bet you can hit... Oh. Come on. Come on, keep going. There goes another head. Okay. We got him. Oh, he's growing heads. Keep going. Keep on going. Next head. Keep going, he's almost gone. Almost gone. Come on, come on. Got him. Wow, he's still blowing up. Holy. We got him. Oh, oh and a yellow heart. Sweet. We got the Hydra Trophy. We got Hydra Chops. We got Fiery Blood. Oh, oh, jeepers. Can't touch this grass block. Is that what hit me? I'm not even sure. Well, there we have it, guys. That was the Hydra. And he actually wasn't that bad of a fight. Not a bad fight at all. I don't even grab all the stuff, I guess. I actually want to fight one of these guys here. I don't know if I've killed one of them. I'll also grab some more of them. I'm not even sure what they are. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Just, yeah, I'm out of here. Oh. Ouch, it hurt. It hurt quite a bit. Okay. Get away from you. Okay, guys. That was the Hydra fight. That was actually a little anticlimactic. We will head back to the castle, guys, and I will just see you guys in a moment. Welcome back, guys. I'm back in my base. Um, had the game crash on me, so I don't know what's going on. Maybe I, I will try updating my job, but it just seems to, it'll just, poof, get me right out of the game. No warning, nothing. So, here I am at my trophy area right now. And we got the 
the Hydra skull. So that is pretty cool looking. You guys have seen all this now, so we shall head into here now. I'll show you this. Hopefully I can do this. I got to start upgrading my ME system. It's getting full. Why? Because of this bad boy right here. The Tesseract. I have a quarry in another dimension bringing items into here. Into the chest. And then down into the ME drive. So, let's just have a look. Oh, it's... There we go. We're good. If I type ore, these are the ores. Here, let's make some space. Make a little bit of space for all my ores. I'll drop you off, I don't need you. Okay, so let's grab the ores that I'm going to smelt. We have so much copper. It's ridiculous. Iron, we got quite a bit. Lead. Lead. Magnesite. Shine, I could... Tin. Silver. Tin. 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 Yellow, right? Zinc. I don't think I do zinc. That's just what I have right now. Let's head over here. And check out... Well, I guess I should have done one more thing over there. But I'll go back. I'll throw some stuff in the smeltery. But... This is what... I'm currently working with, so... What do we got in the smelter? Uh, really not anything. So, let's grab... Boop, 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 boom. Let's grab some silver? Yeah, we'll grab some silver. Pull the silver in. I think so, yeah, I grabbed silver, okay. Are you in? We'll change back to the bird, because... It's just handy. Oh, there we go. Fly over. Done a bit of this work. Um, so let's have a look at this ingot. Okay, so you know, a little bit of here, a little bit here. Thirteen hundred copper ingots. Thirteen hundred tin ingots. Forty four hundred fifty iron. Two hundred sixty aluminum. We have got so many ingots. We type in copper. This is what we have for copper. We got all this. Oh, there's another copper here. That's what came through. 78 blocks of copper here. And then the different types of copper through the game that I found. And it'll keep giving more. As my, um, my thing's going. So, we'll just throw this back over here. We won't bother with it. Yeah, I just, I've been, I sit here. Oh, silver, and I, how much silver was it? It was quite a bit, yeah, 105. Wow, my game's very laggy right now. Restart the computer, update Java, maybe. Yeah, that should. There we go, and I just, I sit here and do this, and then when this gets full, I grab another pile. So, obviously, like, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, nine stacks of copper. Another stack of copper. Ten stacks of copper. So yeah, we're going to have a lot of copper. So that's what's going on here, guys. I will hopefully be able to show you... Yeah, we'll do this. I'm going to hop out. And I'll be right back in the new dimension to show you my quarry. Okay, guys, here we are. We are in the mining dimension. And this is our quarry. I built this little tiny small one here tested out and it worked out amazing and we are currently down to level nine so it is mining beautifully it mines right down to bedrock Ooh, there's a little bit of something there look you can just see all the ores all the ores in the wall so it's amazing it comes in through here I filter out the um the dirt, cobble, and gravel into a trash can. Because who really needs all that? The rest goes into here. And I, while I'm in this dimension, for some reason, it won't go... It won't travel through. So, if I'm here, I thought I would put a big chest just in case. Just in case. Nice big chest. It'll fill up. 
when I leave, it'll start piping through here into the test rack. It is set to my own personal um, frequency. Send items only. You could send fluids and energy. So you can create test racks in one area and power all your machines, which would be very cool later. So, is that a. Must be just an Apache or cobble right now, so. Transfer through here. All this is, it's a flat land. It's flat, as you can see. I don't think there's any hostile mobs. There's a couple um, farm animals out and about every once in a while, but. Yeah, that's all it is. So, um, yeah, here's some chickens. I've seen some sheep. I've sheared quite a few sheep. Okay, guys, I have crashed. It seems to be like every five minutes. Four or five minutes, I crashed the game. So we're just going to duck out of this episode. I'm going to play around and see what's going on. And yeah, so I took out the Hydra and I showed you guys off the quarry here. So I'm going to try to figure, the, figure out what's going on. And we'll be back in a couple days with a new episode. Not sure if we'll dive back into the um, Twilight Forest. Or if we'll try something else out for an episode or two. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Throw a like down if you liked it. And let me know if there's anything else you'd like me to try out. Any other any other mod that you might want me to want me to show you how it works, maybe? I'll do some research on them. And I'll be back in a short little while, guys. So this is Check and Funk the Raven. Saying peace out and have fun guys.